T minus 15 seconds. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. Okay, mission. Pitch and down range. T plus 25 seconds into flight under the thrust of over 5 million pounds. Falcon Heavy is headed to space. We're getting ready to throttle down for passing through the period of maximum dynamic pressure. Max We've Q. heard call out of throttle bucket no, for sidecar. We're through max Q. Vehicle is supersonic. Everything continuing to look good on the Merlin 1D engines. We're throttling back up on the side boosters to full power. A minute 15 seconds into flight, performance looks nominal. Currently the next event coming up in about two minutes, we'll hear call out of chilling of the MVAC-D engine. That allows liquid oxygen to the top of the turbo pump get the second stage engine ready to chill for ignition in just a couple of minutes. We're two minutes into flight. We've begun to decrease thrust on the side boosters to minimize acceleration and loads on the Falcon Heavy structure. We've turned off one engine on each of the side boosters to decrease that load. Now our next major event coming up here in about 10 seconds, shutdown and separation of the side boosters. The view should be the side booster cameras on two sides and the center core in the middle. Booster shutdown. Booster separation confirmed. Cheering in the background, it's going on midnight, but a lot of people here side at SpaceX, side boosters have separated. They're getting ready for their burn back to Cape Canaveral. You can see on the left and right views, the side boosters have ignited. The center core continues under full power. Everything looking good on the Falcon Heavy. Next event coming up in about 15 seconds will be shutdown of the center core followed by stage separation and ignition of the second stage engine. Good views of the two side boosters under the thrust of three engines each, slowing down their velocity and coming back towards Cape Canaveral. We have shutdown on the center core. Stage separation confirmed. We have successful separation and ignition. We're coming up on shutdown of the two side boosters. Side booster, boost back shutdown. And we've heard the call out side booster, boost back shutdown. You hear the crowd cheer behind me. And that entry burn has completed. Note that second engine cutoff and the center core will be landing almost at the same time. So we're going to have a few. Side booster landing burn startup. We've heard the call out for side booster landing burn startup, and there you see it on your screen. See it coming towards our two landing pads. Confirmed 
side booster landing. What an iconic view. We've also, at the same time, second I believe we've had second engine safe. cutoff at the same time. As we mentioned earlier, the center core entry and landing is going to be risky. During entry, it'll face more heating and dynamic pressure than we've ever experienced on Falcon 9 or heavy flight before. Why, you ask? Because we have to lift the second stage higher and faster than other Falcon Heavy flights in order to have enough performance in it to execute four burns into all the different orbits. So coming up at T plus 9 minutes and 39 seconds, we should see the center core entry burn ending. Center core entry burn.